So it's Monday and obviously that's recycling time. Start this first. And then the cat. And that's recycling done for the week. So a new week and we're up to day seven of the TA challenge, which is Seven that list is missable because that's usually completing a game by doing such a thing or not doing such a thing. It's a little difficult, but we're going to try and get at least a few on a game called King's Quest, which I haven't played since back end of 2018. So this will be interesting. Regular viewers will know this it's time for the weight record because the last one was last Thursday in a very busy day. It's good to get one a day before this week because it's going to be another busy one tomorrow with the academy trip. Up to 105 across the board, over 10,000 for the month, not far from 150,000 overall since April, but we'll see. 1470 before the final round, and the record itself, 1575, so 15 better than last week. And with the show going into finals week from tomorrow, which means final rounds are going to be very short, it's good to get a good record. Well, we started it last week as part of the TA Day 9. Which is spelled away with mistletoe. We're back on hand at Halloween 86. To do the M now and to do one of the T's later on, which results in a completion for the week. So, again, it will be on a few times this week. We were on it last night, but we forgot to do a clip. Let's do the I one of the mistletoe, which is Lego Wales on the DLC. So, back on hand at Halloween 86, and the reason that we're double showing this game tonight is because, as you can see, nice work. All achievements locked. So that's the completion done for this week. Well, continuing the challenge, we've just done L and E on Fours Arise and Four on a new mode. I don't know where I can flash it up here. Super Seven, which is new seven different missions. And pretty good addition as well. So later on in the day, it'll be the T, O and the E, and then we'll see what happens with day tens challenges. So, there's the afternoon as we mentioned, and we're here for the academy game, statistics, 339 overall, 315 for Skem, first against Witten Academy, we have become the 134th team, could be a 75th home win, 95th overall win, looking to avoid consecutive losses after Sunday, 11th in the SPFA and MPLFA, 29th in 2021, 46th football in 2020, and 83rd attendance for the year. So, half time here at JMO, Skem is United Academy 2, Witten now no. Jed trainer just nibble up with the goals in the first half. So far, so good. So full time here at JMO Sports Park and it's a sport week. The first of two just like last week. A lot better than last week, let's put it that way. Absolutely brilliant performance. It's game United Academy 6, but now we have won. That's me more than happy. Uh, the Sunday's return here where we'll see the youth against Trafford. Brilliant. Well we've been on Ted just to get the tea. So next up is and this is because it was the only one that began with the letter O that was actually within reason. It's Dynasty Warriors' Strike Force on 360, and we're going on to get something called Online Venture, which to connect online for the first time because when we played it last, the online wasn't working. So that's the O going to be done. So continue with the game on the 12 days. We're on day 12 now, but we've got a bit of catch up to do because it was a busy few days. It's Halo MCC. Yeah, a few, which will be for day 10. Possibly to spread over the other days. Day 11 will be Hogwarts reveals and flying, so Halo might not cover that. And day 12 is to do 12 unlocks with the second unlock beginning with the last letter of the first, so that will be interesting. Also, for anyone who pulls the progress of the weights, usually see the better issue, for Monday it's going to be a different one because this, as you can well, you may not have seen in the past, but when we've done changes, brand new mattress for. The first time in 10 years. Monday's going to see the new frame. So whether or not it's going to affect how the weights work. I don't know. But 10 years. It's the end of an era in that sense. Considering a lot of videos this year have been done from this room. But yep. Nice new. Well Sunday afternoon. <laughs> We're aiming at JMO. For possibly the last visit of this year. For Skem against Trafford Youth. The reason we say possibly last is because as it stands, that we scan Bearsco and the counties 
that ends on the 29th but we never know let's hope this one is a good one so arrived at jmo statistics for this 340 overall 316 for scam second against Trafford duty we played last year a bit of a bad tempered one fourth game since lockdown two ended ninth in the northwest youth alliance looking for consecutive wins 47 football in 2020 30 football in the 2021 season and 84 sport attendance for the year let's hope we can get to 85. So, half time here at JMO, we're on a different pitch than usual, but it's game 18 1, Trafford 1. Bit of a staking goal gave Trafford the lead before a brilliant piece between Trainer and Owls set up Brown at the back post to level 4 0. So far, so. So, full time at JMO after sport week over, it's game 18 2, Trafford 3. Second half was a bit ill tempered and a mistake by the keeper basically cost us what would have been a fair 2 all draw. So, the physical sport ends. Sadly in defeat, we don't know when it'll pick up again because both the youth and the academy are away next week. So we don't know when the first team's going to go. So that's this week done sports-wise, might be a bit more video-wise gaming, but we'll see.